I am Dr. Kim. Today I'm sharing hexagram 3. Okay. Uh, the previous two videos we have done hexagram 1 and 2. Okay. Hexagram 1 talks about um, Okay. It talks about nothing because it's the first quad. It has nothing. Okay. So we want to create something. Okay. And then uh, hexagram 2 says that uh, hexagram 2 is a uh, kun kwa. Okay, so kun kwa says that uh, it's earth, right? Mother earth. So there's nothing and we want to create something. Okay, so we know the earth can grow and multiply, right? So then we proceed on to hexagram 3. Okay, so what's happening right, right now at hexagram 3? Hexagram 3 means like... Uh, Okay, maybe I explain this way. Okay, like you look at the the top, the top trigram. Okay, the top trigram represent sui. Okay, sui. Right, it's the kan gua. Then the bottom three, right, is the lei, the zhen gua. Okay, so can you imagine like sui? Sui means what? Means the cloud is dark, right? Is it? There's a lot of water in the cloud, right? It's heavy. It means the sky is getting dark. Okay, so it looks like it's going to rain. Okay, so turn is like thunder, right? It looks like it's going to rain. Okay, so this one gives you like a scenario. So, uh, what does it mean if the cloud is, is dark? If the cloud is dark, that means is is it is it good to to go out? Is it good to like leave your home and go out and play? Probably not, right? Because you look at the weather. You look at the weather, right? And you know the weather. And you know, like, it's going to rain. So, not likely we will go out. Or we want to plan any agenda, right? Yeah. So, this one has a meaning, like, it's difficult to start. Okay? It means that it's difficult to start. Okay? You want to go out and play. Let's say you, you created something. You want to plow something. Okay? But the sky is, like, going to rain. So, it's difficult to start doing something. Okay, yeah, so this is this is what it means here. Okay, now let's look at uh, the line one. Okay, we always start from line one, remember, okay? And if there's any changing line, okay, the changing line is a significant judgment, okay? Uh, and then if if there's no changing line, then we know line five, okay, it's the master line, okay? Uh, even though, though we know it's the master line, right, or the changing line, is significant judgment, right? We still have to read through the hexagram, okay? Because we know line one is the initial, okay? So it will progress through the final stage. Okay, let's look at uh one line one, okay? Line one means don't move, don't, don't do anything, okay? You know it's going to rain and the sky is like dark, so. Don't, don't, don't go out. Don't, don't do it. Okay? So, wait. Okay? So, wait. Um, if you wait, after the rain, you can still go out and play, right? Okay? So, that's what it means. Okay? So, after the rain, then things will be okay. Okay? So, that's line one. It's cloudy. Don't go out and play. Okay? The line two is somebody, there's somebody coming to ask for a hand for marriage. Okay? Uh, okay? So, this, this girl, she did not manage to get married, okay? Because the, the person who come and ask for, for the hand for marriage, right, uh, has difficulty, right? Uh, so, the girl did not did not get married. Okay, this is an ancient book, ancient book, okay? So, what happened if she didn't get married? She actually waited 10 years later, then she got married, okay? So, what is this trying to say? This trying to say that it's actually a very difficult time, okay? so. You maybe have plans that you want to go ahead, but it's it doesn't look good. Okay, so um, you know what to do, right? Behave, right? And wait. While waiting, you can still do other good things, right? In line 3 in the Asian books, right? It says that uh, if you want to go hunting, uh, without somebody guiding you, Okay, how are you going to successfully uh, or, or have a, like a good hunting trip, right? Uh, 
especially you know hunting you go to the jungle you may get lost right uh, so here says that now is a timing actually to get someone to guide you uh, that that is a good good suggestion okay yeah so get someone to help you get someone to guide you along okay just like you don't know you watch my video and and learn from there okay someone to guide you okay so if there's someone to guide you you can um, you can overcome the obstacles okay uh, if you don't if you don't, you do it blindly, then of course you'll, you'll be in trouble, okay? You know it's raining and it looks like it's going to rain. You just refuse to take your umbrella to go out or you refuse to take any precaution or you you just don't care. Then you will suffer, right? Okay, line four. Okay, line four. Okay, line four in the ancient books, okay? It says that, 趁马纷纷而来,是求婚者。Okay, so what it means that if you get help, right? Uh, if you get help, then it's auspicious. Okay, so life for please means please seek help. Seek help. Okay, you can call me, SMS me, right? Or you can uh, face to have a face to face session with me. Uh, I can tell you what to do. Okay, but of course I charge you. Okay, uh, line 5. Okay, the significant line, line 5. Okay, uh, okay, give you one example. Like, do we help the weak or we help the strong? We usually help the weak, right? Uh, okay, so if you are, if you are humble, weak means if you are humble, right? If you, if you, if you, you if you are polite, a courteous polite, right? And you are soft, gentle, okay? And you ask for help. Be sincere, of course, right? Uh, is it more likely people will help you? Yeah. But if you appear strong, meaning it like you appear prideful, okay, you appear uh, difficult to handle and you think you're very smart, clever, you know what to do, then uh, most likely uh, it will not auspicious, okay? Most likely people will not help you, okay? So remember this squad, we need, we need mentor, okay? We need someone experienced person a good moral person or someone with an with experience right uh, like a mentor or we need supporter right to get us and help us just like you go to this jungle you need a tour guide okay so this is what this one means but if you have a tour guide and you are rude right and you're arrogant you think the tour guide will show you around probably probably not right Okay, so this is the line 5. Okay, uh, do not be too arrogant and prideful. Okay, okay, the last line, last line, line 6. Okay, line 6. Okay, line 6 means uh, it's difficult. Okay, uh, it, it's, it's difficult and uh, you have to endure. Okay, you have to endure and the difficult moment will pass but you have to endure. Okay, so you may have fear, you may have anxiety. Right, you may feel lost. Okay, so it's um, yeah, seek help. Okay, you can call us, call me, write to me, right? Send me. Uh, you can click my website. Okay, you can contact us. Okay, you can uh, fix an appointment for maybe for any consultation. Okay, yeah. So, uh, that's all for hexagram three. Okay. Uh, and this is called Sui Lei Chun. Okay? Sui Lei Chun. Okay, hope you enjoyed the video. And I'll be doing video Excellent 4. Okay, next video. So, uh, hope to see you there. Thank you.